Hi, everyone. It's Patty, your FASD coach, once again with a free Friday tidbit. So this is now June, which means we have a new topic. And this month's topic is abstract concepts. So basically, if you can't hold something in your hand and manipulate it to figure it out, that would be concrete. If you can't do this, it's abstract which means wrapping our mind around something that does not have definite form, right? Quantifiable characteristics, physical characteristics. <clears throat> so what the one we're going to tackle this week is math. Math is definitely abstract. Remember trying to teach your kids how to count and how to understand what the numbers meant can be very, very challenging. And that's an area that we oftentimes see just so much struggle. So one of my friends, uh, her child with fetal alcohol syndrome is now 23, definitely in the realm of adulthood. And he still struggles in, in math. He's still on a kindergarten, first grade level. Another friend, her son is in high school and can do algebra, but still can't get addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, which is a little bit of a conundrum, right? I don't get it. How can they do a higher level when they can't do the basics? And that's one of the mysteries of FASD. So because math is is ab abstract. You can't, I mean, yeah, you can physically put the number of items out there and physically add them up, but that's not very practical when we're dealing with, um, you know, how much money do you have left in the bank to pay bills? Um, when it's trying to add or multiply, I mean, we only have, if you count fingers and toes, we've only got 20. <laughs> so it's just not practical. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, that's this week's challenge that we're talking about in terms of math. Um, definite workarounds around that is um, make friends with your calculator. <laughs> that helps all of us. In fact, I have to I have to jokingly admit that, you know, our parents and grandparents, yeah, they were right. If we rely on the calculator too much, it's embarrassing how long it takes. <laughs> so anyway, I'm not, I'm not outing myself. I'm just saying I'm, I'm not as fast as I used to be. You guys have a great weekend and have a fabulous week ahead. And I'll see you next Friday for another free Friday tidbit when we tackle the issue of money, which is another abstract concept. But for now, if this was helpful, if you could relate to this, please like, share, subscribe. And if you want to join my Facebook group, it's called Caring Connections for those affected by fetal alcohol spectrum disorder. All right. So I'll see you on the inside of that. And I'll see you back right here next Friday for another free Friday tidbit.